Well, the Commanders pulled out a win on their uh, home field Sunday, but something special off the field left some fans kind of scratching their heads. The team unveiled a memorial for the late Sean Taylor on the 15th anniversary of the star player's murder during a home invasion. Taylor was a hard-hitting safety who quickly became a fan favorite in D.C. The two-time pro bowler left a lasting impact with Washington and a future generation of NFL players. Uh, his family, including his daughter there, were on hand for the event. Uh, his daughter Jackie was just a baby when she lost her father. Clinton Portis was Taylor's teammate in college and in the NFL. He said he was glad to see his friend recognized. To know that Sean will always be iconic and legendary um, in this place. No matter where the stadium goes, no matter where the team goes, whatever happens, Sean going to be a part of it. Oh, I love it. I love it. I'm glad for it. Because you know what? Not only is this generation, but there's a lot of generations that follow Sean and want to be a part of what he's done. And this is, this is a goal. Set the goal high so you can reach that, that goal. Now, while the team never used the word statue, they called it an installation, and many fans say they expected more than what they saw yesterday. In fact, fans took to social media. Where else do they go first? Mm. Uh, Brian here saying it looks like something you'd see at Sears touting a new winter collection. This organization doesn't do anything right. Uh, a fan, Kevin, tweeting that Dan Snyder has done it again. The Sean Taylor statue is a wire mannequin from TJ Maxx. What an owner. The uh, frustration was very clear. Cody Bennett used the words beyond embarrassing. Some strong feelings, very strong feelings about that yeah. reveal.